The desert region of Bashar might be many miles from the coast of Algeria, but that doesn't stop its market from being well stocked with fish. This arid area has become home to an active aquaculture industry and fish are bred and caught almost every day. We are here in the region of Jofa Toba. We are two groups of qualified fishers. We have our diplomas and our papers. We fish in this reservoir, as you can see. There are two kinds, the Grand Boucher and the Brim. We fish almost every day. The quantity is not limited. Every day in different parts. Mohamedi has been breeding fish since 2016. He sells to buyers from all around the country. Sidali Hardy is one of his clients. He's been buying fish from small investors and fishermen at the dam for six years and now even sells them abroad. We've been in Bakar since 2010. We have the Silver Cup and the La Grand Bouche. I have markets in Algiers and outside Algeria. We go even to Tunisia. Such is the fascination with fishing in this desert region. Tourists even come to witness it for themselves. They have shown us two or three kinds of fish. It's great. I came from a coastal region, but I've never seen this kind of fish, even in the markets. It's not available in our region. It's just amazing to see this fish in the middle of the desert. Other than breeding fish in the reservoir, another form of aquaculture exists in basins contained inside buildings in the region. These were built by local authorities to breed major kinds of tilapia. The pilot project aims to train and attract local investors in the southwest region of Algeria. The Ministry of Fisheries intends to produce 17,000 tons of fish in 2017. We've had two breeding operations since 2015 in favor of investors from the southwest region of Bashar, Adrar and Tindouf. We bred more than 80,000 tilapia eggs. In this step, we're trying to mix between aquaculture and desert agriculture. The breeding and selling of tilapia eggs to fish farmers also makes the water the fish were kept in available to agriculture for its fertilization and properties. Susan Mongeli, CGTN.